हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू माय चैनल आई एम मंजू यू आर वाचिंग माय चैनल ग्रामर विद मंजू मैम इफ यू आर इंटरेस्टेड टू लर्न ग्रामर लेसन रिमेन रेडी ऑन एवरी थर्सडे एंड ऑन संडे एट नाइन एम सो विदाउट वेस्टिंग टाइम लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड टूडे टॉपिक इज पर्सनल प्रोनाउन Before we go ahead with personal pronoun, let's understand in short what is pronoun. Pronoun is a word which is used in place of noun. The words which are used in place of noun they are known as pronouns. Pronoun has many kinds. Out of which we are going to study today one kind that is personal pronoun. Have you ever thought why the name is personal pronoun? Why not the other name? personal pronoun is named because we talk in this category about three different types of persons that is first person second person and third person now the question is what is first person second person third person first person the speaker one who speaks and the second person is to whom we speak the person बींग स्पोकन टू जिससे हम बात करते हैं हम अकेले तो बात करते नहीं है वी टॉक टू समबडी तो हम जिससे बात करते हैं दैट इज सेकेंड पर्सन एंड वॉट इज थर्ड पर्सन दे द पर्सन बींग स्पोकन ऑफ हम जिसके बारे में बात करते हैं हम जब भी दो लोग बात करते हैं वी टॉक अबाउट द थर्ड पर्सन ओके सो फर्स्ट पर्सन सेकेंड पर्सन एंड थर्ड पर्सन वी आर गोइंग टू स्टडी इन डिटेल अबाउट द अरेन्जमेंट ऑफ दीज थ्री persons okay how do we arrange when first person second person and third persons all three persons are used together in one sentence what do we do can we use in random order no that is what we are going to study today let's understand personal pronouns singular and plural form first person i singular we plural second person you is used as singular as well as plural third person he she and it singular whereas they plural now we have to understand when we are going to club first person second person third person in one sentence what do we do yes so when all the personal pronouns are singular then what do we do the order is Rule two three one. That is rule two thirty one. What is this rule two thirty one? Means when we arrange first person, second person, third persons together in a sentence, we should arrange them in this order: second person at first place, third person at second place, and first person at third place. Let's understand this with these two examples. Example A. You, he, and I had gone to buy our books. If you see here, you second person, he third person, and I first person. What did you notice? Second person, third person, and first person. If we arrange in any other order, then it will be considered wrong according to the grammar. Okay. So keep in mind whenever we arrange. three persons together and the persons are all singular in that condition what do we do we arrange them according to 231 rule by the way if out of these three one is missing what do we do see example b you and i are best friends you and i second person i first person which person is missing here third person is missing here okay so only two persons are there in that condition whatever is missing that we will remove but the order will be followed the same that is 231 i hope this is clear now let's move to the other concept the next concept is when all personal pronouns are plural keep in mind plural or the sentence is about accepting guilt or mistake in that condition the order of the pronoun will be rule 123 means first person then second person and then third person kab jab personal pronouns 
प्लूरल होंगे हमने पहला रूल क्या पढ़ा था जब पर्सनल प्रोनाउंस सिंगुलर होंगे यहाँ पे पर्सनल प्रोनाउन अगर प्लूरल्स है इन दैट कंडीशन विच रूल रूल वन टू थ्री ओके एंड द अदर थिंग अगर हम किसी सेंटेंस में अपनी कमी अपनी गलती अपनी वीकनेस अपनी शॉर्टकमिंग्स को एक्सेप्ट करते हैं इन दैट कंडीशन आल्सो विल अरेंज द प्रोनाउंस अकॉर्डिंग टू रूल वन टू थ्री मीन्स वन ट्वेंटी थ्री लेट्स अंडरस्टैंड विद कपल ऑफ एग्जाम्पल्स एग्जाम्पल नंबर ए वी यू एंड दे विल हेल्प द नीडी हियर यू सी वी यू एंड दे ऑल थ्री पर्सन आर प्लूरल सो इन दैट कंडीशन हियर फर्स्ट पर्सन सेकेंड पर्सन एंड देन थर्ड पर्सन विल बी यूज सो रिमेंबर वेन पर्सनल प्रोनाउंस आर ऑल प्लूरल इन दैट केस वन ट्वेंटी थ्री रूल विल बी फॉलो एग्जाम्पल नंबर बी यू एंड दे विल गो टू द मॉल यू एंड दे हियर यू सी यू सेकेंड पर्सन दे थर्ड पर्सन सो हियर फर्स्ट पर्सन इज मिसिंग फर्स्ट पर्सन इज मिसिंग सो फर्स्ट पर्सन इज मिसिंग विल कैंसल फर्स्ट पर्सन बट ऑर्डर विल रिमेन सेकेंड पर्सन एंड थर्ड पर्सन वाई बिकॉज यू एंड दे बोथ आर प्लूरल subjects plural personal pronoun okay example number c if you see i you and he are at fault okay i you and he are at fault we can't say he you and i or you he and i are at fault remember here i you and he are at fault hum teeno main tum aur wah galti pe hain means we are accepting our Fault here. In that case, also rule one twenty three will be used. Means first person, second person, third person. D, you and she are at fault. You and she, you second person, she third person. Again, first person is not here, so first person has not been used. If by the way the first person was also there, we could have written first person first, then. second person and third person here again we are accepting our fault in that condition rule 123 aapne kya samjha abhi tak jab bhi hum teen singular personal pronouns ko ek sath connect karte hain tab rule 231 use hoga all right and when personal pronouns are all plural in that case rule 123 or when in the sentence we are accepting our guilt our fault our Uh, weaknesses in that condition rule 123 will be followed i hope rule 231 and rule 123 both the rules are very clear if you have any doubt related to this video or the previous videos please write in the comment section till then bye bye let's meet in the next session